Here we have Radar Rat Race for the Commodore VIC-20. This is one of the most common VIC-20 games and clearly a ripoff of Namco's Rally X. While this game doesn't look bad, I'm not a fan of how it plays. Instead of a car, you're a rat. Instead of other cars coming after you, other rats come after you. Instead of collecting flags, you're eating cheese. You still have the smoke screen to help you temporarily stun your enemies to get them off your ass, but in this game it's called Star Screen. Why do the rats have such big ears? They're huge and they kind of look like spread apart butt cheeks with a turd popping out. Like if one of the smurfs was taking a big blue smurf and shit. The music is clearly a butchered rendition of Three Blind Mice. It repeats in a loop and mixed with the other obnoxious sound effects, you'll want to shove some dead rats in your ear holes in an attempt to block out at least a little of the audio diarrhea that's raping your ear holes. The big ears, the fact that you're eating cheese, and the crappy version of Three Blind Mice makes me think that they didn't know the difference between rats and mice. They just sort of merged them into one being. What's up with the stationary black cats? Did they just wake up and didn't know what to make of the situation? There's no way that they wouldn't rip those rat-mouse hybrids to shreds. Well, okay. Maybe they got that part right. Hard to say, really. This game was later put out for the Commodore 64 if you feel like subjecting yourself to this torture on a different Commodore system. Overall, this is a game that I don't suggest having. If it happens to come with the VIC-20 or if you find it for a nickel somewhere, cool. But otherwise, pass on this one. I think you're better off just playing Rally X, even if it's emulated on MAME. This just isn't a very good clone. This has been Radar Rat Race for the Commodore VIC-20.